All right, guys. I don't know if any of this is gonna work, but we'll see what happens. All right. Uh, everyone kind of got trained up a little bit, just through uh. So everyone got trained up a little bit just through um, like me practicing the battles and stuff. Like I I can tell if I'm gonna win, you know. Um, but I did get two new people add onto the team, or one and a half, I guess you could call it. All right. So first off, we got Jasper, Gengar, got it up to 80. Took forever, but it it wasn't too hard because. There's been a lot of decent spots to train with wild Pokemon that are at like level 50 and stuff. And um, towards the end, I got to kind of switch train against uh, Blue. So it wasn't the worst thing ever, but it definitely took a while. Um, so this thing, I have big plans for it. I don't know if it's going to work, but it's basically there to wreck shop. All right. So first off, we got Confuse Ray. If we wanna, if we wanna like try and hacks the crap out of something. Same for Curse. Uh, basically, a lot of things this Pokemon does is like I'm gonna do this right before I die, and it's gonna screw over whatever Pokemon's in that's in. Whether it be Toxic, Destiny Bond, Curse, Confuse Ray. I basically gave it everything I could to make it like trolly and like supportive and stuff. Um, I gave it Quick Claw because I'm pretty sure Blue's Arcanine is still faster in this thing. Um, one of the things I do know is that Blue's Tyranitar is not faster than Gengar, so I could easily Destiny Bond on it and it just drops, so that's something to keep in mind. Um, but I got, <laughs> I got this man over here, Jelly, in an attempt to maybe replace Cloyster, but I'm not sure, maybe just for this battle. Um, but I wanted something that was good against fire and could also take electric moves. So Arcanine can't really touch this thing, but it can because it's still extremely strong. Um, but I gave it Surf and Amnesia to like boost its special stats and then be able to hit really hard with Surf. Um, I gave it Mud Slap. It did have Earthquake, but I was like, nah, let's just all the support we can. And that's also why I gave it Swagger, but Swagger, I'm not gonna use that one as often. So, we'll see how that works. Everyone else is the same, no one's different. But, yeah, so we have, uh... We have, uh... La 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 la... What are it? We have Steelix? I can't remember the name. We have Steelix and Cloyster in the box, for now. So, we'll see how this goes. Give it a shot. I don't know what's gonna happen. We still need to get lucky on some parts. Um, I gave Gengar the Quick Claw, just so that way it could be faster and get rid of Arcanine, because honestly, Arcanine is the problem. It's completely the problem. Um, and I don't even know what his last Pokemon is still. So that one might be even more of a problem. Uh, but I did also level up Spanky, so it for sure lives a Surf and it can two hit KO with cross chop without needing a crit um oh yeah i also gave yap detect just for things like kind of like arcanine i guess it kind of worked well because i actually like semi stalled it out of thunders which was interesting but it's just kind of there to be there i didn't need bite anyways um <clears throat> but yeah uh so spanky can two shot Lapras with cross chop, which means if I crit Lapras, then it dies. So that's kind of a cool thing to keep in mind. And these levels are still completely ridiculous, but let's see if we can crit this man, Spanky. And I can easily switch around against Espeon and then go out into Venusaur after it's out of Psychics and beat it, no problem. Alright, we didn't crit him. He's gonna go for a Surf, and we are going to finish him off with the cross chop. Alright, so he's gonna go Espeon now, so this is where things get a little switchy, and I gotta make it wear out the its Psychics, so 
we got one, two, three, and it also can't hit us with jump kick, so that's amazing. Four, it basically has to stand here doing nothing until it runs out of psychics. Five, six, that was six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then we should be able to go out into Bum Dumb now. It's just going to jump kick us. And we are going to attempt to put it to sleep. Get our HP back. And then try and take him out. And then here, I'm hoping he goes into Arcanine, which I think he will. Oh my gosh, stop waking up so fast. And stop missing Bum Dumb. Alright. So, this is the moment of truth right here. I need the Quick Claw to go off. So I can just Destiny Bomb the Arcanine and get it out of here. Because that thing is way too big of a threat. Honestly, I might not even need Jelly. But it's more of like an attempt to back up. So, let's see. Come on, Jasper. We need that Quick Claw. Oh, that works. He missed. So now, if he takes us out, he's gone. And that time we got the Quick Claw. Unless it's like a speed tie or something. But he's going to Fire Blast. That's going to take us out. And we get to take out the Arcanine. Finally. The one thing that we could not beat with this team. The HP goes down so slow. It's ridiculous. It's got to have, like, insane amounts of HP. All right, so Arcanine is gone. I think I'm going to go out into Jelly here just to see who he goes out into. Celebi is his last Pokemon at 150. And that's not going to do so well. It, Yeah, Jelly. Alright. You're just going to die. Celebi, huh? Hmm. Should be able to beat this thing with Yap. But I could also beat it with Bum Dumb if I stall it out of Psychics. But I don't know what its other move is. Alright, I'm going to go Bum Dumb and then I'm going to go Yap. Because I'm pretty sure he's got Psychic. I don't know what other moves this thing gets though. Alright, we're going to try and stall it out here. But I don't know what his other move that he'll go for with this is. So let's see. So we had it use one Psychic. Ancient Power. Okay, that's horrible. And that's not gonna work well. Gungum, maybe be faster and freeze it. Oh my gosh, nothing is... Gungum isn't faster than anything. Can I freeze this thing? That would be amazing. That's like the kind of luck we need right now. Ah! <laughs> yeah, of course he has a full restore. I, I honestly wasn't surprised. I'm gonna detect... What did he do? Ancient power? I can't beat Tyranitar at this point anyways. I'm just gonna flamethrower. So he has ancient power. Okay. I think I'm not gonna bring jelly. Okay, hold up. Yeah, I'm gonna bring... Um, I'm gonna bring Steelix. So now Steelix is useful, for sure. Let's go, Goldfinger. Show him what's good. All right. So this could potentially help us beat Celebi. Not Steelix will beat Celebi, but it'll help us switch around until it's out of Ancient Powers. And then it'll have Psychic and Giga Drain, which are not good against the app so I think with everyone coming together we need the right amount of luck too against Arcanine then we could totally do this alright Spanky go get him alright we got crit well then we're not gonna count that uh, let's just go Gungo 
Alright, how about Goldfinger? Okay. So this thing is legit level 150. Yeah, none of none of this is working. It's chill though. It's chill. Things have to go like super according to plan for us to beat him. 150, that's crazy. That's so high. Alright. Flamethrower. Easy part done. Spanky. It's just con it it constantly gets more and more risky throughout the battle. No crit. No crit on his side either. And we don't miss. Nice. Alright. Time for the stall. Alright, one psychic. Two psychic. Three psychic. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Now I'm gonna go Jasper and then go Bum Dumb. Alright, let's do it! Kill it! Damn it. Damn, Giga Drain does a lot. No! Stay asleep and die! Alright, there we go. There we go. Alright, Arcanine. Jasper, it's on you. It's on you, boo. Hey! There we go. That quick claw coming in clutch. I like it. Alright, you got it, Jasper. Alright. So here, he's gonna go into Celebi then, right? Alright, so he's gonna Psychic. It's more important to get rid of the Ancient Powers than anything, but... Alright, so we're gonna go into Goldfinger on what we're expecting to be an Ancient Power. Okay, so that's one Ancient Power. So here he would go for the Grass move. So we're gonna go Bum Dumb. So we have to switch between three Pokemon. So he's used one... Alright, hold up. I'm gonna write this down. Psychic... Ancient Power and Giga Drain. Oh, that's gonna be hard. Alright, so now we need to go Yap on the Psychic. So that's one more Psychic. Then we need to go Goldfinger on the Ancient Power. So it's one more Ancient Power. Then we need to go Bum Dumb on the Grass move. Whole team working together on the Giga Drain. So he has 5 of everything except Psychic he has 10 of. Alright, so 3rd Psychic. And now Goldfinger on the Ancient Power. So he's used 3. Bum Dum on the Giga Drain. Alright, we got this. And then Yap on the Psychic. Good, good. Alright, it's a it's coming too. It's about that time. Alright. Four ancient powers. Oh, he got the boost. It's gonna make it a little bit harder. So bum dumb on the Giga Drain. Alright, he only has one more evolved and left. So we should be able to do this other than Psychic. Psychic he's used five. So Goldfinger on the last ancient power. And then we gotta go Bum Dumb on the last Giga Drain. And now he should only have Psychic. I'm gonna use Detect. Sleep Powder. Alright, so he has Sleep Powder and Psychic. So he can't beat us. Even if he puts us to sleep, it doesn't matter. It can't touch us. So we just wait till we wake up. Start flamethrower in. We get a crit. And. Oh, I thought he would die to burn. Alright, he's gonna heal. 
We burn him again. Oh, we got this in the bag. Stop healing. Just face it and die. Yeah. Yeah, all right. We're not out just yet. Spanky, it's all on you now. All you need to do is hit a cross chop. And we can all go home. Spanky, you are the chosen one. You always have been. Make it happen. Bring us our 16th badge. I can feel it. It's in sight within my grasp. No! <laughs> Spanky! You moron! Wait. I remembered stocking up on a few more items. Alright, hold up. Because I know Spanky can live a rock slide. Yep. Sacrifice yourself. We have one max potion. Alright, Spanky. Come on, you son of a gun. It's still right there. We got this. It's going down so slow. Gosh, I didn't think it was possible. Flash him! Wow, okay. Way to go, Gungam. You had to do one thing this game, and you failed! Everything worked, but Spanky couldn't kill a Tyranitar with a cross chop! Oh my gosh. I didn't know that was possible. I honestly didn't know that was even possible. For a Tyranitar to live. A cross shop. From a Spanky. And now I have no revives. Stop dropping the ball, Spanky! Now I have to start that Celebi again, too. Alright. One Psychic. Two Psychic. Three Psychic. Four Psychic. Five psychic, six psychic, seven, eight, nine, you're ten. Okay, bum dum, destroy. Stop waking up. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, bum dumb. You literally have missed a good majority of your razor leaves, and I don't appreciate it. Jasper, I know you pulled through last time and you did a great job, but you got it again! Oh! <laughs> okay, okay. He's going Selby now. So what order should we do this in? We need to stall him out of the Ancient Powers and Giga Drains first. So let's start with Yap. He went Tyranitar? Why? Why did he go Tyranitar that time? Alright, now I have to go Gungum. Flash never works. Way to go. Spanky! Okay, well, now there's already no hope. 
Spanky is messing up nonstop. What's wrong with you, Spanky? This is your fault. I blame you. Oh my gosh. All right. Let's try this again. Spanky, stop messing up. Yeah. That's what's up, Spanky. That's what I'm talking about. The whole team needs to come together on this one. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. And we'll go Jasper and Bum Dum. Uh. Uh. Put her to sleep. Oh my gosh. Stop missing. There you go. All right. Jasper, I'm sorry to constantly ask this of you. I don't even know if the quick claw is going off now or if we're just faster. But either way, you're doing a great job, Jasper. All right. I guess we have to go bum dumb in case he goes... I don't know. Okay, now we win, Salvi. All right. Let's start it over. One psychic. And now into Goldfinger. One ancient power. One giga drain. It's so tedious, but it's so necessary at the same time. We have the immunities for a reason. Oh, he already got the boost. That's not good. One ancient power, one giga drain. Another psychic. Another ancient power. Oh my gosh, he crit us with giga drain. That sucks. Another psychic. Another ancient power and the boost. Might have to sack bum dumb here. To the fourth Giga Drain. But then he's not gonna use Psychic. Let's see if this works. Alright, Giga Drain. So then we're gonna go Spanky. He's gonna Psychic again. That's five Psychics. Five Ancient Powers. And last Giga Drain. I feel like I could go Yap, but his stats have increased so much. Or Gungum. Or Yap, yeah. But I'm thinking we just go Gungum. Yeah, let's just do that. Alright, so now he only has Psychics left. Do I have any potions? I'm now realizing that they could come in handy because... Goldfinger could live an earthquake from Titar in case Spanky drops the ball. But for now, we just spam Flamethrower. It's like one of those boss fights that has like a million different parts to it, you know? And we gotta just like work through it. Just gotta work through. I'm just gonna start using Crunch. Lower that Spadef. What did it just use? It's struggling? Did it go through all of its psychics? Oh my gosh, and he has a full restore. Why does struggle do that much? Okay, we're really getting beat by a struggling Selby. How did that even happen? 
Someone tell me.